Jeff. Yes, Grant. What are we playing today? Today we are playing Battle Princess Arcadia. Battle Princess Arcadia. Wait a minute. Uh-huh. Is this a JRPG? Uh, yeah. Yes, it is. But I think you're going to like it. It's a bunch of people, and they're all androgynous, and they have the power of believing in themselves, and they fight pink mecha Godzilla Pokemon. Wait. Uh, just shit. Roll with it, man. Come on. Roll with it. I don't know that many battle princesses, Grant. Do you? Um, have you met many battle princesses in your life? Warrior princesses? No, no, not not warrior not full princesses. Full on warrior, just a no, battle princess. Just a battle princess. Uh, no, no. I, guess I've, I've, I don't think I've ever met a princess. Okay, well, you're going to today because we are playing Battle Princess of Arcadius here on Rage Select. My sweet God, there is not very much out right now. <laughs> uh, uh, this is, we're uh, reaching the bottom of the barrel. Well, huh? okay, this is, and you know what, Grant? This is your favorite developer. This is Nipponichi Software. Oh, These are the yay. guys that made, um, yeah, 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 that uh, Hundred Night, uh, Witch in the Hundred Night. But I think you'll like this one a little bit better. Uh, okay. I don't know. It's a little bit more straightforward. Even though people... <laughs> it's Strawberry Shortcake? It's Strawberry Shortcake Battle Princess. Cool. Okay. I would watch that show. Oh, also, yes. Totally uh, all Japanese uh, dialogue. So <laughs> uh, I like how she really... You know, you're going into battle. You're a battle princess, right? Uh -huh. That is a really short skirt for a battle princess. Is it an iron skirt, though? <laughs> is that a thing? Someone was saying that uh, it's like a like hair shirt. Metallic breast plates are actually terrible for fighting. That would like get you killed really quickly. Oh yeah, yeah. like like the flash molded to the boobs. Yeah, plates. it's better for women to just have a solid chest plate as well. Okay, just squish in the boobs. Yeah, I, I guess yeah, you can tape those down. Yeah. Boys don't cry. Brienne style. of Tarth, like her her armor doesn't have like uh, boob mold. injection molded boobs in it. So. Yeah, she got that from uh, Jamie though. Oh no, motherfucker, oh. Dill. <laughs> Mega stomp. Dude, you're getting a Dell. <laughs> she should have known when she saw all these dead bodies here. Like, uh, Come on, dude. It's just your uh, your organs are all over the place. It's going to be fine. You're going to get a Dell. Even you can't defeat it. That's not the line, is it? Dude, you're, you're getting a Dell. Yeah, dude, you're getting a Dell. That guy Nobody. lost his whole uh, contract deal because uh, he got busted smoking weed. Oh, yeah. I That was one of those things where I'm like, who, who cares? Yeah. They're like... <laughs> That sucks for that guy because, like, two years later, he would have been fine. Right. I mean, like, <laughs> I would be like, okay, cool. That's more credit. Like, for uh, seriously, I don't want to go back in time or anything. Okay, she's princess of the Schweppes Kingdom, the what? Schwert Schwert Kingdom, the Schwert, the Schwertz. Is that very Schwert cake? So oh, good one, Grant. Yeah, right. Good thanks. one, Grant. <laughs> Look at that crown, man. It looks like it would just. It looks like you could stab him. Yeah, you could. With that. You could just jump into them. It looks like a bunch of Reddit upvotes oh. on a crown. Oh. I like the goose. Yeah. He's just out there. Mm -hmm. He's got uh, quite some swagger. No, we're going to skip this because I played the battle controls already. So this is just a side-scrolling kind of action game. Uh, it's going to get a little bit more interesting as soon as we get done fighting this motherfucker. The, the pink god neck warrior Godzilla? Yeah. Pink, uh, pink, uh, yeah. It looks like a Pokemon character, actually. It really does. I hadn't actually put that together before. Something about the crown. <laughs> oh, oh, yeah. Ouch! I choose you. Yeah, that's right. Disappear in the light like a bitch. Whoa. What? This is hurting my eyes, Jeff. Okay. Well, you know, I keep the brightness on my TV turned up so high that, you know, whenever we play a horror game, Grant, I usually have to go in and do like a gamma adjustment in my video editing oh, geez, because my really? TV is so bright and the stream is not that bright. Is that why you're wearing sunglasses? That's why I always wear sunglasses. Yeah. You were you were punching me earlier, <laughs> telling me to put on the sunglasses as well. That's right. And I was like, why? I we had that whole you put know. on the glasses. I like. No, I'm not wearing the glasses. She's like, get back here, Mecha Godzilla. You a punk? Yeah. She's also wearing like stripper boots. Apparently, those are lovely. But maybe she just has like some height insecurity, so she wants the extra boost. And maybe it's because her head is so big. She's got to offset her center of balance. I was considering <laughs> <laughs> that that could be it. She probably has terrible neck problems. Oh, Her chiropractor is like, I, I'm sure that the like 60 pound <laughs> golden crown doesn't help. Hey, like, wake up, baby! Your your spine is fucked right now. What is up with your head? I I, I might it's been a while long long time since I said this, but I actually knew somebody in high school. This woman who had a big head. Her chest was so big she had to have reduction done because yeah. she was having like back problems. Like, yeah, it's, that's the common thing. I think once you get above like a. Even like at D's, yeah, double D's, and it's like that the, can be wait, put a lot of stress. Western reaches of their the name of the of nation vertex. is Vertex. Yeah. Okay, 
Sounds it's a sad. it's a very math filled world, Grant. <laughs> Vertex also kind of sounds like a like a maxi pad. The land was overrun by freakish monsters who did great damage. Okay, the king it's built an army and stationed soldiers across the land. That's what you do when mm -hmm. freakish monsters over. I mean, we had a freakish pro monster problem here, but it you, you know we just distributed soldiers throughout the land. It <laughs> we was just fine. adapted to the hipsters, That's right? <laughs> <laughs> hipsters, you can stay. We'll just feed you PBR. You're good. That's right. Uh, or s have you ever heard the term blipsters? No, it's a blipster. I heard that today. Uh, this is a black hipster. Oh, ah, okay. Uh, I read it in an Port article. Manteau. Yeah. A okay, she is the battle princess. Why a P though? So I don't, I don't know. No, okay, that's because that's how you spell hipster. Yeah, <laughs> I'm stupid. B L hipster. I'm right? like, why should? Wouldn't it be Blixster? <laughs> no. <laughs> um, I'm an so idiot. So this game actually, all, uh, Grant, uh, bears a striking resemblance to this uh, game called Dragon's Crown. Dragon's oh the with the, the big booby jiggle woman man. giant yeah yeah those those would give a woman back problems she needs breast production surgery there yeah. I don't know how she was even standing up so this is this is Sigurd who is the battle princess's brother and the regent of the land who's been turned into a goose for I don't know why <laughs> because anime but you need to blow the whistle in order to transform him yeah but did he did he like have the goose like the, at the top of his throne, right? If you look <laughs> up there, is it a goose? He's got geese on the side. Maybe, yeah, maybe that's his like that's royal like symbol. Like when he's like, oh, you like geese a lot. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna make you one. Yeah, I like. What is the? Are they doing like a see no evil, hear no evil, speak no evil? Yeah, are those ducks like, doing that <laughs> yeah. up there? Oh god! <laughs> All right, so we're getting introduced to Routes, who is the new uh, like, he's the new like uh, squire to yeah. the crown. Yeah. Okay. And the so princess. So join your team. Yeah. Is sufficiently. She's very anime kind of airheaded. Like, she doesn't want him want the dude to address her as my lady. Wants her to just be like, "Yo, bitch, what's up?" Everything's so fancy, except for like all the text is coming in on this like college rule paper. <laughs> <laughs> you get torn out of a notebook. Yeah. <laughs> That's weird. Well, like, yeah, here's the little uh, spiral bound little dots on the side. Oh, I think that I, first I thought she said she says I really like hate speech for a second there. <laughs> I was like, uh <laughs> this game just took a real weird turn. I don't know if this is the game for social commentary, you guys. Saying all these slurs about geese. Yeah. <laughs> <Get Really what? laughs> Avian hate speech. Yeah. <laughs> Calling him a feather butt. That's actually really offensive in the geese community. Feather butt? Is yeah. That, you can't that's our word. Yeah, don't refer to us as that. <laughs> um so basically, uh, Routes is coming in here. He's going to be the new squire, and we're going to go out and uh, fight on some monsters. I hope that Plume and Routes like develop a, a relationship. Do you think? Is that? Yeah. Do you think that's possible? Love interest. I wouldn't see that coming. D but look at his dreamy eyes. Yeah, and he, I mean, he's got the same exact body as her. He's very ka kawaii. Yeah. I don't know. Maybe. If I don't she's know into what herself, means. she'll be into him. Yeah. Looks just like her. Put this red brain. wig on, boy. <laughs> <laughs> you can be my uh, Princess Amidala, Queen Amidala double. Oh, yeah. Body double? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's Kira Knightley's just entered the scene. I had no idea that that wasn't just Natalie Portman, like, CGI'd into, like, I didn't six either, different roles. Yeah. It was like, uh, you guys kind of chose someone a little bit too good. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. And then we got one more that's coming with us. Do you watch boop, Adventure boop, Time? Boop. Uh, I've watched a little bit of it. They uh, they occasionally have this. Uh, so here's the rabbit lady. Oh boy, Uni. Yeah, Uni. this is. I mean, I hope you like cute little little girls. <laughs> <laughs> That's a weird way to say it. I, I know. I couldn't think of a better way to say it. Uh, <laughs> Like, cause the thing I, is, I feel like I, I, there's no good way to answer that. Do I say no? <sighs> Look, man, they're they're kind of short, right? Chris Hansen gonna bust in the door in a second. Like, okay, so you're an artist, Grant. You know how to draw, right? Yeah. Okay, so you know that when you're drawing like younger people, the way that you generally do it is you draw shorter, older. I mean, not like babies, but Shoulder, like shoulder, chubbier face, big so, old, bigger eyes, yeah. bigger head, just big head. bigger head. And these, they have big heads. They, yeah. I don't, it's kind of like an anime style, though, right? Yeah, a big little head, bit. Big eyes. But it just makes them look like all underage and creepy to me. I don't, I don't know. And I watch anime. I mean, I've seen my fair share. I don't It'd be know. Funny if you just saw them like kind of teeter tottering back and forth like Baby <laughs> Huey. Ooh, ooh. My head's too big. Yeah. Although Baby Huey's head was really tiny. His body was just very pear shaped. Okay. So 
There's a panda bear. Panda bear. With the skull head and built-in, like, suspenders, or I don't know what those are. I'd have never seen pandas look like that before. Yeah, death, spe- death, uh, death head pandas. Yeah. Evil. Stupid pandas. Let them be extinct. That's what I say. <laughs> I want to put a bullet between the eyes of every panda. I just say, like, save its species. if they're not going to breathe, then just let them, you know, do whatever they want. I don't they're know. They're probably sad because you keep them in a zoo or keep killing them. Well, I don't have a zoo. Not this you. It's not a personal zoo. All right. <laughs> uh, so uh, this is the first. and Twitter birds. That's right. <laughs> yeah, the birds, they all have afros. I don't know what the hell that's all about. So basically, up in the upper left-hand corner, you can see that I've got, like, uh, an SP meter, an HP meter, and the uh, XP meter. Is this another one where you represent all the other people on your team? Nope. Or you can switch between them. Yep, you can totally. Here, I'm just going to do her super real fast. Okay. Do a super. Yep. Whoa. And then I'm going to switch out to somebody else. Yeah. So she's a wizard. Um, and everybody has, like, a different kind of set of attacks. Uh, like, uh, plumes... Ma- attacks are like all in a one, two, three, and then like a modifier. So you hit one, two, three buttons, and then another one. Yeah. But hers are like one, two, and then something else. So and she throws like uh, ra- rabbit raisins at people. That's right. She's just, yeah. Just shits and just, throws it in like, yep. like a filthy animal. Like a filthy goddamn animal. Uh, and then she you like just shits out like 20 kids. And you, that's and right. And they're down. your problem. Yeah. That's, I saw one time this, uh, you know the show Hoarders Grant? Yeah. Uh, there was one Hoarders that was about these people who had basically had rabbits that they just weren't controlling that oh, had just geez. gotten into the walls and there was like a billion of them. It was fucking insane. They had one with cats that did the same thing. It was like an entire floor filled with cats and they're just like jumping around like like Mexican jumping beans on the, off the floor. And... and I it wasn't smell a vision, but I swear I could smell. You were just the gagging the entire cats. time. Like, ah. So this guy, he does all Terrible. all bow attacks, um, which okay. makes him a little bit more difficult to use. But he also has a slide attack. Whoa, yeah, that's cool though. Um, all the all the uh, attacks seem to be like modifiers of like oh, uh, you can do stuff like that. But it's all like hit a couple buttons and then hit a direction and another attack button, and that's how you do the. Why am I not getting XP for the this? The graphics are pretty cool on this. Yeah, they're a little. I mean, you know, like I look at, I compare it to Dragon's Crown, and Dragon's Crown was a little bit, a little bit, bit better. I mean, just a little bit higher fidelity graphics than this. Yeah, uh, there's, there's but, sort of this, this bubbly, bright playfulness element that. I'm trying to think of what it reminds me of. I mean. Obviously, there's elements of that. Are oh like shit! Okay, so he Miyazaki-esque, died. Yes, I have to guess. So oh, I you just killed a guy. I just lost. Jeff my, just killed a guy. Uh, Jeff killed a guy. It was crazy. I'm gonna go ahead and switch Allowed back over to his own bro to die. Plume because she's, she's the best. The strongest. Yeah. Well, I, I just like her attacks more than the re- the, the other two. I they mean, they obviously do that so you like her the best. The 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 um, archer guy. I mean, he can like double jump, which is pretty cool. But oh, okay. He's, his attacks aren't very good against these huge squads of birds. Like, he's much better at fighting, like, the pandas than he is at fighting the birds. I'm going to switch her up. No, wait. I'm going to do her special attack. Jeff, if we could do jump, double jump in real life, uh-huh. that'd be pretty badass. I agree. I mean, I you mean, know. Oh, how, how shit. Would, how would one man manufacture a boot that allowed, like, an extra... I guess it would just, like, be you rocket, jump and rocket then you boots. a little rocket boost. Yeah, a little rocket boot. Little ro- I, dude, I would... I would put down some money for rocket boots, man. But would you? What would you use it for? Like, uh, I don't want to climb the stairs, man. I want to get on top of my house. <laughs> uh, so then, every time uh, when you get done, you get a bunch of different rewards. Like, I got okay. some uh, healing potions, and then these are like upgrade materials, and there's blue feathers and stuff. You're and on top of money. This. Yep. Oh, well, I decided, Grant, um, a, a few weeks back, to just start playing like just a little bit of the games that we play before we start. Because like, if this game was like The Witch and the Hundred Night. Uh, <laughs> we were a mess. Yeah, well, we no, what I wanted was just to be able to skip over, like, some of this stuff, right? Yeah. Like, I know everything that they're saying here. Like, they're talking about the upgrade mechanics. Ah, uh, okay. And they're saying that one of the uh, one of the monsters dropped, like, a weapon, which seemed really weird because they're all panda bears, and that's going <laughs> to lead into this new, this, like, new threat. So. It's a, t- it's a panda claw? Yeah. I don't like their walking animation. It's really stilted. I don't like it whenever they don't make the walking animation match the feet. Is this a cheaper game? I think it was thirty bucks. Like kind of. Yeah, I think it was thirty bucks. I mean, it was uh, a. It was. I think it might be. I don't know if they put out a disc for it, but it's PS3 download only. 
uh, or I downloaded it. It was like a gig, so okay. it's not like a super huge thing. It's kind of between like your twenty dollar indie game and and your sixty dollar main game, right? Yeah. It's the sort of thing that I guess if you finished everything and you're into games like this, like you know, it's a pretty good deal. Huh. So many teardrops. All right. Don't be so sad. He's sad because you killed him. That's right. Oh, the goose is sad. Oh, I was talking about Adventure Time. That's what I was talking about. Oh, There's yeah? this character called Choose Goose from Adventure Time. Uh-huh. And he talks like this. Oh, and like... And everything he says is a rhyme. Like but the... It sounds kind of like... Like the Candy King from... Yeah, Candy uh, King. From, Alan uh, Tudyk, yeah. Uh, yeah, from uh, uh, Wreck-It Ralph. Wreck-It Ralph. Or uh, um, I always think of the Mad Hatter from Alice in Wonderland. Yep. As we tried to make uh, one of the characters on Rage Select, we tried to make him talk like that, but... We kind of. Well, I wanted <laughs> him to exhausting. talk like Snagglepuss, but then we just started going into that, and it, it became so irritating that I started ir irritating myself by doing the voice. It's hard to talk in uh, in this voice without feeling like I'm yelling all the time. Right. <laughs> so yeah. we set. He set up a giant weapon depot, and almost like the monsters raided it. Oh so, damn it! Choose Goose. Yeah. Whatever your name is. Sigurd. I'm gonna call him Choose Goose. Choose Goose. Okay. Off on a brigade wide. Oh, yeah. Why wasn't there? Why weren't there guards? Because they were off on a brigade wide team building barbecue competition. Uh, I want to have. That's a, as irresponsible as the police in see, Dark Knight Rises. That's got a really. That's a really good point, Routes. How do you turn barbecue into a competition? You have never been to Texas before, motherfucker. Yeah. <laughs> we have that shit like four times a year. Routes, get out of here. Yeah. We should get some barbecue. I'm really hungry, man. What's your favorite barbecue in Texas? In Austin? Or in Austin? In Texas. We could say Texas. In Texas, it's Blackstown and Lockhart. Lockhart. In Austin, it's Rudy's. I still haven't been to Lockhart to get barbecue. Oh, man. There's one place down there. Um, I don't remember if it's Kreutz or Smitty's, but it's one of the two of them where um, uh, they won't. They have no barbecue sauce. Good. Uh, and if you if you talk to them, they're like, Barbecue sauce just taints the meat and it covers the real flavor and you're not supposed to have it. And I'm like, motherfucker, I don't care what you... I don't care about you and your fucking ideology. You give me... I want barbecue sauce. So give me some goddamn barbecue sauce. But that's the whole like argument between Texas barbecue and uh, places like uh, uh, Tennessee. Like Memphis. Or something. Yeah, they'll be like, oh, our, our barbecue is best. And they're like, our, our sauce is the best. And you're like, well, in Texas, you don't need sauce. Yeah. Boo yeah! I like Game me some. Match. I like barbecue sauce. I like uh, the kind of. I, I do too. Rudy's vinegary barbecue sauce. I I just like the uh, the whole claim that we we don't need it. We don't need it. But I I still prefer it. <laughs> uh, so I'm gonna yeah, go Rudy's ahead. Great. See, I'm gonna go ahead. I'm gonna dequip all of these because this is they've got this set up in a really stupid way. So they've got like each one of these slots for items they've got with an individual potion. Yeah. But you can just like take three potions and put them like in one slot oh. so I'm gonna give these guys some potions and last time when I played this we I did some grinding before we went to uh, whoa I don't boss. even know about that yeah every time I say that uh, Jason makes uh, jokes because I say I had to go grind on some dudes and they're just <laughs> like yeah. yep so I think you've also got this whole upgrade tree where you can take the stuff that we got like this blue quill and it's gonna add three like ice damage to my sword um, so I'm going to go ahead and update these with some various damage times. Ice damage. And Does that gonna... mean you're going to go against fire people next or something? Uh, Maybe. Maybe. Oh, okay. Maybe. Who could say? Let's see. I'm going to go You could. You've well, already played well. this before. You could give me all the... I hints. could I could spoil everything. Yeah, you could just summarize what's gonna happen. We can just call it quits <laughs> right here. All right, so then what happens next? And then the last boss is a turtle, and uh, and then Jeff it went and played magnificently. You should have seen it. <laughs> Rage select out. That's right. <laughs> um, so I think okay, are we ready to go now? Do you have a sign off for Rage Select? Me? Like like when you guys do the podcast? No, I just say it's like see you next week or whatever. All right. Um. Oh, okay, so basically what we're doing here is we're getting ready to go fight whatever it was that raided the armory, uh, which is a whole different kind of weird battle. I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm going to skip this, I think. Skip it. I think. So this is the ambassador, and she's totally in love with the princess, 
and oh. she's here to tell us there's a giant monster that we got to go fight. And her name is Marion. So she's in love with Plume? Sort of. She's all like, she's all anime giddy for her. Oh. And then it gets. Well, poor Routes. I thought he, had, he stood a chance. I didn't know that Plume was unavailable. Yeah. I'm going to go ahead. Although Marianne kind of looks like one of those, uh, those. She looks like Knives Chow from <laughs> Scott Pilgrim. <laughs> I was going to say one of those those monkeys with a fez playing uh, cymbals. Oh, because she has a weird fez. <laughs> She's got that crown. All right, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go ahead and skip. This. Wait, is Routes a lady? No, Routes is a dude. This is Battle Princesses. What's that? This is Battle Princesses. I thought maybe, maybe Routes is supposed to be a princess. That's no, 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 no. No, I can. I can like say. Like Marianne had a crown, like she's a princess. No, I could tell you that that is not the case. Oh, none of them are princesses except. No, her? She, yeah, she's the only princess. Oh, uh, okay. Like the one of them, you know, the dude Routes is a squire, and then the magic lady is like an advisor, and that other woman was like a. Uh, ambassador, and that so. one is like a bunny. Yeah, the mage. What are those? Uh, pe- the, she's a furry. Shh, shh, shh. Okay, yeah, I'm yeah. gonna. You know what? How much time we got left, Grant? Over uh, there, probably plenty, right? We got ten. Ten minutes. All right, that's enough to do this. I think. Routes is gonna get his ass kicked. We're doing a battle party. That's right. So there's three different types of battles in this game. One is where you're just out in the woods killing stuff. Yeah. And then this is the second type, which is called, I think, like. Siege or major battle or something like this. Bunch of dead bodies everywhere. Yep. It's just I, I, because of Game of Thrones. I'm like, you gotta burn those corpses. Got burn them. Pink Mecha Godzilla's back. Oh boy. Um. So you know what? I'm gonna. Uh, we got ten minutes, and I want to. I want to get through this battle. So I'm gonna skip this. It's gonna tell us how to do this battle mechanic. But I already know. Yeah, you already did it. We saw you beat him before. Well, in this one, you don't just have your three people. No, I don't want to talk about what? sieges. You've got a bunch of other... Okay. You have I, triplets? No, I've got you? like a bunch of NPCs with me. Okay. Uh, so I'll explain what they're saying here. What's an here. NPC? It, non-player characters. Oh, so NPC, the, okay. I've got an army, essentially. That 150 on the left represents my army. And the second line is like their morale. And okay. on the other side, i got the boss. And he's got a um, So a you have shield. 150 people and he's got 4,000? He's got 4,000 health. Oh. So I can change, you know, before up there, you see in the upper Holy right-hand shit, corner. you got a ton of people. Uh, you see how I've got this different formations? Yeah, yeah, So I can, like, switch them to defensive formations, which makes their, they don't attack, but they, they don't tend to get fucked up as much. Um, yeah, yeah, I know. I think all these ladies are princesses. I'm going to write on this. They're just all princesses? Yeah. You're going to write your They're own pr- story, Grant? Yeah. Uh, so I'm going to go They're ahead and switch them gentlemen. to basic formation. And then we're going to go, fuck this dragon up! What? And see, they're going to all get killed as they fight the dragon. Ah, okay. So the first thing that we have to do is a little blue bar down by the dragon. We have to get a shield down. That's what I'm trying to do right now is, oh, okay. is wear down his shield. Um, and then once the shield is down... Oh, you still got more people? Okay. Yeah, they regenerate. So even if they all get knocked out, uh, ah. then I just have to fight the... I just have to fight the dragon all by my lonesome. Uh, those one, those girls uh, in the little beret look like Cammy from Street Fighter. Yep. Oh god damn, they are fucking fucked up. Okay, I'm gonna go and try and try to. So yeah, 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 yeah. Give a little more tips. Okay. Um, I'm gonna have them retreat actually. So what'll happen is you'll see that when they leave the battlefield. Um, oh shit, the princess got killed. Oh uh, yeah, I, was, <laughs> I, I just figured you changed characters. Nope. She totally got murdered the fuck up. Uh, 3,564. You're just going to take it all down yourself. Well, no. See, on the left-hand side, they're regenerating. Uh, shit. This oh, is a problem. Oh, yeah. It's doing a recount. Okay. Yeah. So You're almost, You almost got all the health down. Well, the thing is that I have to, yeah, I have to get the shield out. There you go. And then I can actually start damaging the his health. Now you should bring him back, right? Uh, they, oh, I guess not. Well, let me see if I can bring him in. His health this is back up. Well, I need the I need the brigade to help me. Uh, um, oh, fuck! But I didn't realize that the battle prince. I didn't realize that Plume was almost dead. So, it, but when I did this before, I spent like a good twenty minutes just building up my level in the forest oh, before so coming in to do this. Stronger. Yeah. So it was no problem whatsoever. So yeah, a little. Yeah, work for it a little more. Yeah, a little bit. Yeah, hustle, Big Daddy. Shit. I'm sorry. Okay, I well, you Big Daddy. He is out. You know, I love it when they call me Big Papa. Um, yeah, <laughs> is they including Grant? Yes. Wow. Everybody. I'm honored. Big okay. Papa. Uh, 
shit. Oh, god damn. This is, this is a serious. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to make it die. on this one, Grant. Oh, crap. I think I just got knocked out. Yep. Totes knocked out. Dead. Um, Dead as a doornail. All right. I'm going to go, I'm gonna go in back to the woods and get a couple of levels. <laughs> <laughs> so we'll take on the dragon again in part two. That, um, didn't, that didn't happen, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. Don't worry about it. You didn't see Jeff not close. That, yeah. that wasn't what happened. He's got this all. shit. All right, let's go ahead and get uh, old Routes up from level goddamn one because he is useless. But see, now you can see when I attack them, I've got a little, a little uh, ice stank on my arrows. Oh yeah, yeah. So, Ooh, oh, okay. So he's got this little experience bar. This guy keep leveling up. Yeah. See, it is kind of a little Castle Crashers ish. Is that a little? I mean, you gotta just keep leveling up your characters. You can, I guess, you toggle between them here. Yeah, uh, and I mean that like in side scroller. I forgot, you know, I brought a bunch of potions into battle with me that I could have used, and then I just didn't use them in that battle with the. Uh, okay, so I think if I can just get a little bit more, there we go. Shoot him! All right, now he's up to level three, and I'm gonna bring her in and get her up to like level five or six or something. Um, yeah. So this is like the major part of the game, and I gotta tell you, man, like this part, uh, it's real mindless, but it's fun. Yeah. You know, you're just running around. A lot of times, you're way more powerful than the shit that you're fighting, and it's just like, yeah, fuck you, birds. But no, I've not a whole big struggle. I mean, I've seen it like more further down into the game where there's more. Um, it's not all pandas and birds, right? Right, right. <laughs> okay, yeah. good. I think eventually you'll get to like skeletons and shit that actually matters. Oh, okay. I mean, because I don't even know why these birds are so ill tempered, Grant. I don't know why I said that like you made them ill-tempered or whatever. Ill-tempered? Are these birds angry? Oh, they're so angry! I'm hoping that I can get through all of this and then get back to that boss fight before we're done with this first part. I really didn't plan on dying to that boss. It's okay, man. You 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 tried. I did. That you put yourself out there. Sometimes things don't work out. There you go. You leveled her up to four. Okay, and let's bring in this guy, get him leveled up. Shoot, shoot those fat panda bellies. The pandas are really worthless. I mean, would the, you eat a panda? Oh sure, man. I eat whatever. Clone me a pan. Clone me some panda meat. If it was cloned, I don't care what it is. I kind of, I, I like. You eat cloned human? Sure. If it didn't ever have a brain, I don't see why not. It's not mm. like you're depriving somebody of their, their. You know, you're hunting humans or anything like that. What about bugs? Uh, you know what? I feel like. I have this personal philosophy, Grant, that if human beings continue to consume a thing, we're gonna have to eat bugs. Uh, it'll probably it's there's probably a reason for it. Like if something is just like really foul tasting, most of the time humans won't eat it. Like or it'll be very rare. Yeah, but like over in China, there's a lot of bugs that are like a delicacy. Sure, I mean, I people see that are happening. all over all over it. Like you can eat fried scorpion and. I give it a shot. I mean, I don't think I want to eat a spider, but other than that. They have big tarantulas you can just chomp on. What? Oh, uh, guess what now? Boom. Nice. That All was right. cool. Bring in the battle princess. Let's go have her go. What? Were you close to leveling up that <laughs> um, I guess a little bit. You're going to level her up. Oh, see, I don't know how to do those, like, uh, those, like, attacks where multiple people come in all at the same time. Are these bad guys, um... Infinite on this, like, you, or it's is always the same. Level? It's always the same layout. So I think oh, I'm, okay. I'm done now. Well, they, what? Yep. Grant, have patience for like three more seconds. <laughs> <Jeez>. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna go get some uh, defensive things for these guys, and then okay. we're gonna go try that again. Good. Take all. Take all on exit. I think I've got enough money to get. Uh, let's see. let's go back to the town real fast. Do 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 do. Uh, get some better weapons. Well, no, I'm gonna. I'm actually gonna spend the money on um, equipment. Oh, okay. So here we've got these little charms that I can get, and these are all gonna give me bonuses to my um, oops, to um, defense. So it'll make everybody stronger. You said you've been to Japan before, right? No, I've always wanted to go. Oh. I really always wanted to go. Um, uh, there's like some some video game stuff there. I mean, there's like some stores that sell crazy video games that I'd like to check out. Yeah. Um, I'd like to just go. I mean, and just see the. I'm a sucker for other cultures. I like seeing how other people live. Yeah. So. I think it'd be great to go over there. I'll yeah. Go to check out Tokyo. I'd love to go to TGS. I'd love to have a reason to go to TGS. Um, What's that one? That's the Tokyo, Tokyo. Game Show. Okay. 
it's like the E3 for Japan. Ah. <clears throat> we know some people that are over there, right? Oh, yeah. I talked to Toshi last night. Yeah. We talked for a while about... Um, he was actually tipping me off to some uh, some horrible shit that happened with the way that JoJo's Bizarre Adventure was put out in Japan. Oh. Uh, that I was not aware of. Damn, huh. man. He is really wrecking shop on my dudes or ladies. I guess they are all ladies, aren't they? Yeah. Which makes me think that uh, that little archer. No, he is a, not. A lady. He is definitely not. There we go. Got him down. All Maybe right. He's uh, one of those lady boys. Let's. Oh, uh, tequila slave? Tequila slaves. Okay, let's. Uh, you guys attack. I actually do not know the whole history of that. Oh, uh, the lady boy tequila slaves? Yeah, what is that? What is that? Uh, well, when we were playing Red Dead Redemption, there was a character. How did his fucking shield come back up? Um, when we were playing Red Dead Redemption, there was a character. There's a part where you go to the Red Dead Redemption version of Mexico, right? Yeah. And there was this, like, captain that had this, like, super little fey boy that was serving him tequila. Ah. And so we had the lady boy tequila slaves. Um, damn, you can't And then you had block? some cocaine princesses. Well, before that, yeah, Jason had created the Gary Marzipan. Oh, damn, man. Um, gang known as the cocaine princesses. I'm really hoping that I can get... Fuck, man. So you guys made warring factions between these two teams? Well, it, it you off? know, we thought it would be nice if our fans had a reason to become adversarial with each other and <laughs> fight over who was better. Like, you know, this is America. This is what we love in America, right? <laughs> would you ladies get over there, please? And yeah, fuck this dude up? Your your army's being kind of pusses about this. Well, they're, like, there's there. 23 of them. Uh, I actually want to change them to standard formation. Actually, you know what? I'm just going to have them retreat. Uh, Do they retreat if you go over here? No, oh, you, you have go. to tell them to leave. It's one of the... Run away! And then I'm actually going to switch back to get some potions on my main characters so that they don't die. There we go. Good call. Boom, boom, boom. No, I was blocking. This you Jeff guy, he knows what he's doing. You son of a bitch. You have to use more potion. I don't have any more potions. Uh-oh. That was all the potions that I had. For all of them? Damn. Okay, so it really does not... You can't cancel out of the thing. You should have spent your money on potions. Oh, I was able to dodge that attack by switching. That was cool. Let's try to do, do that, that again. every time. What the fuck? Who are you even shooting at? <laughs> There's something wrong with this lizard. Yeah, he's got problems. He's blind. What? Oh. You're attacking a handicapped lizard. I don't feel good you about jerk. that. Okay, looks like uh, the army is ready to almost about to come back. Yeah, what was your total? 150? Uh, uh, yeah. 130, okay. Yeah, oh, man. I switched. I switched. Shit. Call in the gang. Okay, let's see if I can bring them back in. Uh, <laughs> he loves music. Oh, there we go. What? All right. Uh, I want them to be... I'm going to... Oh, shit. Okay, switch out for routes. Or plume. free hand. Uh, this battle princesses nope, nope. fight. The evil pink bat warrior got zero. Okay, would you guys, don't wait for me. I'm going to be over here. Okay, so now you see that little yellow bar down at the bottom of yeah. the monster? Yeah. Uh, that is his, um, like, fatigue bar. If we can get that all the way up, then I can do a, a, a super attack on him that will really screw up his, his business. Oh, wreck can, his day. If I can not die. You know what? Can I bring in routes and do his super attack? Nope. This one. There we go. Mega arrow? Yep. Boom! All right. And then we'll come back in with Plume. Now you should do her super attack. I guess uh, you want to It's not it charged right up. Yeah. You almost got it. Oh, there you go. Okay. Let's so now it. he's stunned. Now yeah, we do yeah. showdown. And then we go, Ooh! And then you hit the oh, X button. Uh, and then she Whoa. comes out. Wah, broom. And she goes, bow. And he goes, what? And there's this blue realm. <laughs> Speed lines everywhere. <laughs> Swing. <laughs> and he's still not dead. Yeah. He's, That's but right, he's though. mostly dead. He's mostly dead. Yeah. I have yeah. got enough to get rid of him now. In fact, I think if I can get uh, Plumes, oop, if I can keep her from dying, I might be able to get her special attack all the way up. Ah. Which is, Whoop. oh, that's, uh, I see it. Okay. Get it, get him, get him, get him, guys. Get him, get him, get him. Get him. I should probably change them over to, um, they've got a, oh, there he goes. Okay, so now he's dead. Woo! 
You did it. Beat a dragon. All we, right, folks. We did it. Uh, yes. Grant, I could not have done it without you. Uh, I'm, I'm your cheerleader. Um, all right, folks. Well, we're going to come back tomorrow for another part of Battle Princess Arcadia. Um, this has been Rage Select. If you're watching this on YouTube, hit the like button, hit subscribe. Uh, if you want to see these videos one day earlier, you can go over to RageSelect.com. Uh, if you want to buy this game, I don't know if we're going to have a link for Amazon, but if you want to buy anything through Amazon, uh, just click through our website. We get a little piece of the action, and it really does help us out. Uh, if you'd like to support us more directly, we've got a Patreon description video down there that describes how to do that. You basically kick us some money. We kick you some videos as a thank you. Uh, Facebook, Twitter, all these things exist in the Rage Select universe. And Grant, we're going to come back for one more part tomorrow of the Strawberry Shortcake versus Pink Mecha Godzilla. Sweet. You know, Grant, if the pandas won't breed, I think that we should start using them for war machines. Battle pandas? Yeah, we can strap some machine guns to the side, and we can ride them into battle. It'll Riding be the them? cutest war ever! Yes! Yeah. Oh, I love that. We are going to get so much shit from PETA for this. <laughs>